Permit issued ID. You cannot go up. Don't I'm sorry. You're, you're, you're assuming. You're assuming everyone has a government ID. No, no, we're not going to authorize personnel yes, areas, sir. Right. Just, the, just the publicly right. accessible areas. That's all. Don't. You have to check in, man. Okay. No. You have to check in. Don't touch me. You have to check in. Thank you. What's your ID so that you chosen not to give What if I don't have an ID? You've chosen not to give us an ID. What if I don't have an ID? Maybe hang yourselves on this as well to be part of the Snowflake family? <laughs> that. So I noticed this is off Martin Luther King Drive. You guys are familiar with Martin Luther King, right? Junior? Like civil rights, right? We're just exercising our civil rights to uh, not have to relinquish our Fourth Amendment. Could y'all smile? All right, Liberty Trollers, we are back at it, exercising our rights, freedom of press under the First Amendment of the United States Constitution. Out here with uh, J-Town Press and Joey Surreal, and of course, yours truly, Liberty Troll. We will be uh, heading inside here shortly. I'm not sure what the name of the building is, but it should be on the screen by now to identify what this is. We see that uh, this property is protected by video surveillance, so they shouldn't have a problem with us bringing some extra protection. And I don't mean condoms. All right, so this is a private building that, that shares both private and public offices. Some of the public offices or government offices are the Corrections Department, Human Services, Solid Waste Management, to name a few. This is the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Office Plaza which is ironic because the folks inside don't have the slightest clue of what civil rights are. Miami-Dade Miami -Dade County. Welcome all visitors. Please check in with security and present a valid government issued ID. Yeah, that's third country stuff, third world country stuff. Are you telling where the bathroom is? He said it's this way. Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah, they got cameras all around the building, just in the lobby area. See, we're not going to go into any authorized, pers authorized personnel only uh, areas because those are restricted. Anything in there? That was the Department of Solid and Waste Management. You say sorry? Yeah, I know. Excuse me, sir. Why? What's up? Is this restricted? You have to check in to go in. Check in where? No, I don't. At the front desk. You that's not, that's not true, sir. No, it's not. You so have, have to show your ID. ID. You have to show your government issued ID. You cannot go up. I'm sorry. You're assuming, you're assuming, you. you're assuming everyone has a government ID. Not we everyone has one. Video. You cannot go up. Yeah, we don't need to show you. You don't want to die on this hill. You cannot go upstairs. It's not a law, You cannot go upstairs. You can't, dude. You cannot. You guys are just making up your own pot your own laws. It doesn't work. That's not the way it works, bro. Show your ID and mm -hmm. check it at the front desk, sir, mm -hmm. and we can let you go. We're, we're, we're following the law. We're following the law, sir. You do. Come on, man. We're following the law. Uh, you guys. We just want to take right? some video, dude. That's all we're doing. Dude. Okay. We don't have to show ID for that. What's your name? What's your name, sir? My name doesn't matter. You work here? You're the public servant, right? Yeah, sir, no. sir. I'm nobody's servant. I can tell sir. you that. 
Well, you, you are punk. Well, you, work, you, you, not work for you, you work. Well, you work for the government, sir. In a government building. You my my taxes it's pay your salary. Building. So you, you do knock off the freaking elevator. This is what they did to me last time. What's your name? What's your name, sir? Could you identify yourself, name and badge number, sir? You're not gonna identify yourself? No. That's not that's not professional, sir. You're professional. Hmm? You're professional. What ain't professional? Everybody check in to go upstairs. You're not checking in, so I mean, it's not. It's a public problem. building. It's a public building, sir. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It's private only. It's like, do the but research. It's, You'll find out. Yeah, but it's occupied by government. It's it's occupied by a governmental entity. It makes it public. Same rules apply as a public building, sir. Respectfully. Obviously, it don't. Well, we, we know what the law is concerning public. We know the law, and that's why y'all can't go. No, yeah, obviously you don't, because you're you're putting policy over law, sir. I know what your policy says, but I'm not here to abide by policy. I'm here to abide by the law. So like, in North Korea, you may have to show identification everywhere you go, but in America, wherever our tax dollar, whatever our tax dollars pay for that offer services back to the public is, and as long as we're staying in the publicly accessible areas, uh, we're allowed to take pictures and video and. We can. No, you can do that. We don't. We don't That's have not to. A problem with that. That's not a problem. But the, the, the issue you is, to, then you want to uh, try to get access to areas you're not allowed to without identification. So the issue is not relinquishing our Fourth Amendment right, which is the show ID, right? That's the issue. But it the issue. but it's the a Fourth is, Amendment. You, you're not going to go nowhere. Right? That's the issue. I mean. <laughs> Yeah, but it's it's discrimination. You guys are restricting our movement to move freely. It's, it's, it's the rules. What is accessible to the public, sir? Not every area is accessible. You know what I'm saying? Not every area. You can't area. go to any company and just go anywhere. Yeah, you know? authorized personnel can't go in Same there. Thing. Exactly, exactly. And you have to have ID, right? When you go to authorized per personnel, right? We're not going to authorized personnel yes, areas, right. sir. You just the, just the publicly accessible areas, that's all. Yeah. So when you go up. This ain't going nowhere, right? With the elevator. So. Yeah. This is exactly yeah. what they did to me. Yeah. Sir, could you identify yourself? Are you the uh, supervisor? Is he your supervisor? Are you the supervisor? Sir? I'm assuming you're probably the supervisor. How you doing, sir? No, yes, sir. Uh, could I get your name? Because I'm not getting anybody else's name. No. You're not going to yeah. identify yourself either? What's that? No, I'm going to go for the process. Right. But you still have a space there. Mm -hmm. Right. What's your name, sir? Eddie. Eddie, Eddie. nice to meet you. Okay. You're the first one to identify yourself. Yeah. <laughs> are, you the, are you their supervisor? No. No? Who's the supervisor? It's not in this building. There's no supervisor in this building? You guys are all the same. You all have the same rank? Yeah, you can pick the elevator. Oh, okay. So this guy, the, the tall gentleman right here, he's, he's not the supervisor. No. No? Yo, I'm not going to go. Don't. You have to check in, man. Okay. No. You have to check in. Don't touch me. You have to check in. You have to check in. What's up, though? You good? Please let the elevator go. Yeah, you can't get on. Blocking it. Go up there. We'll go up there. You have the cops because they're now trespassing. I'm trying to go up to the A trespass. A trespass is a secondary offense that needs to be attached to an actual primary um, law that's being broken. You seem like a nice enough guy, dude. You don't need to be part of this. It's above your pay grade. <laughs> You let me in the elevator. So Here, I can go police will handle it. Police will handle spaces. it. Your job is to observe and report, brother. Here, just step aside. I'm not gonna. I don't want to push through you. 
How you doing? Oh, they usually keep it locked? They always keep it locked. Jeez. Yeah, High I security don't. in this place. <laughs> so we're just trying to go like in the publicly accessible areas. That's but they're, they're saying we, we, we but, there's, areas, but they want to violate our Fourth Amendment right um, in order to uh, come in here. Uh, how do we get upstairs? Yeah. The elevators that are not working. Oh, right. see, we're just trying to get the public space. That's you it. You can come down. You just can't go up. What's up there? What services do you have for the public upstairs? Our office. Well, I work for code enforcement. And that's, yeah. Right. That's what we're trying yeah. to get to. Yeah, but you have to have class. tickets and stuff to go up. Like, you tickets have to, give you to a public space? Well, you have to have basically... Um, I told him I'd give him my name. I don't know why Yeah, you can, but you have to check in. If you check but in, the, I, I told him I'd give him my name. But did you give me your ID? I have one. We don't want to relinquish no, our Fourth Amendment. I can't get an ID. I told you I'd give you my name. Right, I understand, but unfortunately, that's their fault. Well, it's a violation of our Fourth Amendment. You understand, right? Yeah. You can leave it, you can leave it locked. It's fine. I fed you up, but I came back to them up. They have to check in. They want to go out. Get on the other side. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Man. You're the biggest clown in the whole building. Straight up. Tyranny. Tyranny. So how do you feel, sir, about getting a million views, a being a tyrant? From, from a public building, without being a crack. Trash tyrant. I hope they call the nine one that way. It's you know, it's an emergency camera. That's who it is. So you guys got cameras all around the building. So I don't. You guys can keep an eye on us if you really had to. Why do you guys have such a fear for the people? Kevin, right there. I got a picture of his uh, ID badge. Who funds this building, sir? Or funds the space? Who funds the offices here in this building, sir? Our taxes. That's right. Hey, you guys could um, maybe hang yourselves on this as well to be part of the Snowflake family. <laughs> <laughs> that is good. Yeah. That is So some of my subscribers like to call these guys uh, rent-a-cops. I hear people call them rent-a-cops or mall cops. It's a nice tree though. All I want for Christmas is to go up to the uh, upper floors. So I noticed this is off Martin Luther King Drive or whatever. You guys are familiar with Martin Luther King, right? Junior? He was for civil. You guys like, you know, you like civil rights, right? We're just exercising our civil rights to uh, not have to relinquish our Fourth Amendment in order to enter into our building and go into the public spaces. Think about that. Think about that. You guys are on the opposite side of civil rights. Can I speak to a supervisor? Who's a supervisor here? Well, this guy's a clown. He can't be the supervisor. That's a diversity hire right there. I mean, if you go into a third world country, guys, there you have to give identification everywhere. But here in America, for public, you don't have to do so. I mean, no, you guys got a policy, but it's a violation of our Fourth Amendment right to not have to identify ourselves to enter into a building that's public. So it's not a private business. 
It's funded by our taxes. Each and every one of you pay taxes, so do we. We just want to enter into public accessible areas. I don't know what the big deal is. Yeah, you're pretty lame, dude. Excuse me, sir. I want to get into my uh, building. So your job is to observe and report. Observe and report. Hey, sir. How you doing? Are you a supervisor? Are you, are you a supervisor, sir? My name is David. David? Help you. Hey, David, I'm Zach. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Zach. Okay, so I um, appreciate you identifying yourself. You're like the only other person who has besides this gentleman. We're just trying to go into the public accessible areas in this building, which we have a right to do without having to uh, identify ourselves, which would be a relinquishment of our Fourth Amendment right. So you guys are violating our rights to enter into our building, which we don't appreciate at all. So Your we just ability? want, we, it, we pay taxes, correct. So this is a public, you guys are, you guys are a government entity occupying the space, correct? You guys yeah, offer no. services for the public, right? So as they probably pointed out, you have access to all of this area on the first floor. And on the second, where they provide services for the public. Mm -hmm. So for the record, on record, do you want to sit here and say that there's no departments upstairs that have public access? There's no lobbies? or waiting areas upstairs? You have access to the first floor. You're not answering my question though, I just asked you a question. Okay. Okay is not answering my question. What's your ID so that <coughs> you've chosen not what to What if I don't you, have an ID? You've chosen not to give what us if I don't have an ID? Than that, correct? I, what if I don't have an you ID? Chosen, you've chosen not to give us anything more than you've that, You've chosen correct? to violate my rights and I'm not gonna allow you to do that, sir. Uh, okay. Okay. You believe in civil rights in this country, correct? Thank you. Okay. Still have lots of questions. You don't have to give your photo ID, sir, just so you know. Yeah, it's not even referencing a, uh, a statute. Tried to get on quick. Yeah, I know. I tried. I tried that last time too, but it was too late. <laughs> <laughs> I tried doing that too. So you got you got the closest, didn't you? I did. Yeah. <laughs> I tried to go under that guy's arm, but then he put his arm down and hit my head. <laughs> I said, "Call the other cops so we can trespass." Right. So we'll see. Oh, yeah, but it's yeah. Metro. It's Metro D. Right. So let's see. We'll see how they do. Yeah. The different police departments. Yeah, they, they can be really cool. But uh, they could be really cool. They could be. Yeah. They, it's just this public access. I know, I'm not looking at going to the rest of the building. I just want public access. But they can always say so. Do what we're doing is to agitate. Why? Is that a black Jesus or a Santa Claus? Black Santa Claus. Yeah. <laughs> Let me get a shot of this.
Could y'all smile? One public employee guarding an elevator. So it's three public employees, three salaries that the taxpayers are throwing money at to waste our money. Why, did you feel something? I was trying to get them to look up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's pretty much it, folks. We stood around for a little while longer and decided to move on because these employees, these DEI hires, were not going to uh, move away from the access points to the upper levels in this building, uh, preventing us from gaining access into the public offices. Uh, we waited around for law enforcement, which we weren't sure were even going to arrive at any time anyway. So we had some other places down the street we wanted to visit. Uh, so this video really serves a purpose of simply exposing the way this plaza <clears throat> our government decides to operate within this plaza and we pretty much did everything we could do we pushed back on this unconstitutional policy uh, we made our points but uh, we didn't want to go in circles all day so hope you enjoyed the video for the entertainment value and for anything you may have been edified from watching it um, regarding the fourth amendment and you know how to deal with tyranny in america this is Miami-Dade County, which is a cesspool of tyranny. If you are a patriot looking for some place to expose and exercise your rights, Miami provides an unlimited source of tyrannical operations for you to uh, challenge. And that's because you have a lot of people from different countries that assert their own ideas from a third world country into a uh, free society trying to turn our free society into a permission society. That's a big part of the reason why you see that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. This is Liberty Troll. Freedom, baby! Out.